What's going on? Mike Newman here with Inside Natural Bodybuilding at the conclusion of one of the biggest shows in the nation, the 2013 NMBF Natural Southern States. Just got over with, just concluded the Friday night portion of the show. The this show is so damn huge, it's a two-day event. The figure girls are here tonight. Got the bodybuilders on stage tomorrow. I'll be here for that as well. Be sure to look at my videos on YouTube for that. And I'm standing here with one of the newest IFPA pros, Ashley Lewis. Ashley, how's it feel? Amazing. No, I mean, no words. I am so excited to take it to the next level. Yeah, I would imagine so. Now, I first met you back at the OCB Midwest States. Uh, what'd you, how'd you end up doing to that show? Uh, what'd you get first place? No pro card, though, right? I got second place overall okay. at the OCB show, yes. Yeah, I knew you were right up there. I think you, I might have called you. You, picked, it was, you were my pick to click on that day. That's why I thought you won. But you didn't get a pro card nonetheless, but you got it tonight. What kind of changes did you make in your diet between November of last year and tonight? Um, well... <sighs> I can't really say the changes I've made in my diet. I just, um, I took a little off season, yeah. um, you know, put a little mass on, and um, then when I when I leaned out, I surprisingly gained a lot of more mass in my legs, like I wanted to, and yeah. fell in exactly the way I wanted to. Um, and I'm really looking forward to taking another off season after the defect show on the 11th and maybe building some more legs. Here, do some quarter turns real quick so the fans can see what, what the newest IFPA Pro looks like. Do all, all around, all four shots too. Just do them all. So you're doing the Defects show, one that's May 11th, and uh, that's your next and only show for the rest of the year, I take it then, huh? Uh, May 11th, and then I'm actually gonna go Defect Worlds um, in Miami. Okay, well you shouldn't look like you're, look like you're gonna be a pro to reckon with, that's for sure. And did you bring the physique that you wanted to bring tonight to this stage, and uh, how close to you? Certainly did. I did. I'm very, very pleased with my physique that I that I fell into. Um, I I couldn't be happier. Um, I really can't wait to put more mass on, um, right. maybe, and then just put some more legs on. I can understand that. That's it. What's your stage weight tonight compared to back at the OCB show in uh, November? About seven pounds heavier. Really, seven pounds? Because you look tighter and you plus you're heavy. So you put on muscle yeah. and you got tighter. Yeah, I put on. Um, I, yeah, I, I definitely put on seven, five to seven pounds. Um, and I mean, leaner wise, my legs fell in a lot better too. Um, you know, so yeah. my abs came in sure, even better. Sure the hell did. I, you know, um, yeah. I can't, I, I'm pleased. All I'm right. So, so you're with the complete package now. You've been with the complete package since late last year. You got with them. I think you got right before the OCB show last year. So you spent an entire off season with them. So did you stick, I guess you stuck to your numbers because a lot of competitors, they get to the off season and they don't really diet that hard. But when it comes time for a show, then they dial it in. But you stuck to your diet even during the off season, and that proved to be the difference maker, wouldn't you say? Um, absolutely. I had a very controlled off season diet. Yeah. Um, you know, with refeeds and everything still checking in every week. You know, making sure everything's going according to plan yeah. and not falling off at all. Actually, I I think. I mean, I did the weekend after that, you know, kind of refilled my body, um, you know, like we, we, we do, we, and then we shock it, and then we go right back to reverse dieting, yeah. and then make sure that you don't, you know, tr gain weight, and then go back, it's bad, so your off-season can fall in a lot better, yeah. and then you're, you just follow the off-season plan, and then you fall into the lean plan, and your, your prep's actually easier. This is the easiest prep I've ever had, yeah. because it was my third prep basically in a row without falling off because I just stuck to it and kept going. Yeah, well, that's what happens when you stick to it in the offseason. I think the difference between a pro and people that don't get their pro cards is the people that turn pro, they're the ones that stick to their diets in the offseason. Yeah. Because if you don't stick to your diet in the offseason, you're probably not going to bring the package you need to bring to get your pro card. So nonetheless, what, are you going to the after party tonight? Uh, actually, no. Oh, uh, damn. Well, I'll be there. So I'm going to, maybe I'll see you tomorrow night. Are you going to be at the show tomorrow night? I'm going to be here, yes. I'm okay. going to be here. We have another girl in bikini. Yeah. Kate, you have to look out for her. We'll be looking, for, we'll be looking out for her tomorrow night. We're going to get loud here at the Southern States in Liberty, Missouri. Until next time, ladies and gentlemen, it's Mike Newman, Ashley Lewis, brand new IFPA pro and figure. Look for in the future. We're out of here. Thanks for watching.